To operate the Winspiro Pro software, once installed from the CD provided, simply find the Winspiro Pro icon on your desktop and double click to open the software. On first activation, a parameter box will be displayed by Winspiro Pro. Here you can change settings such as language, measurement unit, turbine in use, method of communication, and the predicted source. Once you've filled in all these, as shown, you press OK and the software will open. From here, you're ready to begin management of your patients in Winspiro Pro. To begin with a patient, simply look at the toolbar at the top and the icons are designed to be operated from left to right. The first section of the toolbar is related to patient data. To enter a new patient, click on the patient icon and click on new. Here it will open up some fields for you to enter the patient data. Please note everything with the red asterisk is a mandatory field. Once you've completed the data, simply press save and then a visit card will automatically open by the software. Please enter any further information pertinent to the visit, such as height and weight. Click OK to confirm your new visit card. Here you can also enter any further notes. Click save again and close the visit card and the patient toolbox. Once the visit data is entered correctly, you can move on to the second stage of the toolbar, which is the testing. Here you can conduct tests such as FBC, VC, MVB, and SPO2. For a regular spirometry manoeuvre, you can click FBC. Please ensure prior to this point, your device is connected and the turbine is inserted correctly. Once you click on FBC, the test dialog box will open. It will display information in the bottom right hand corner around the disposable turbine or the turbine in use. Here, you can simply press start and get your patient to conduct the test. Once the test has gone for the mandatory six seconds, you'll hear a loud beep at the end and you can press enter to accept the results. Here it will take you to the results screen to enable you to see how that test compared against the predicted values available. To run another test, simply from this screen, click FBC and run another test. You'll see here, once the second test is run, it will display alongside your first test. Please note the software will automatically assign the best test based on values for your pre and post tests. From here, it will give you information on the top of the screen regarding test repeatability and interpretation for the test. Once you've completed all required FBCs and are ready to do a reversibility test, then simply go up to post BD on the top icon, click on post BD, it will give you information around the default medication for the patient. 
can select from a list of FBC post sessions also. Once you've put the software into post mode, the background will go green. Just waiting for the warehouse to finish up wrapping now. is he started doing it after I'd fucking already clicked post and once the post button is selected the background the Winspiro software will turn green and it will display information on the top regarding bronchodilator. Once you've gotten to this point, you can go back to your testing bar, press FVC and run another test. Once you've run another three FBC tests in post mode, it will display the post test in the results alongside the best pre-test from the previous tests. From here, it will also give a percentage change so you can see the efficacy of the bronchodilator. Once all pre and post testing is complete, you can go to your results page, click on your pre data, click print, and it will display all the information in an easy to read printable format including any post-testing conducted. It will have full patient demographic, quality control information, and instrument information included on the result. 